Another one of our rockets never got off the ground. Millions of dollars in taxes. Poof! Up in smoke. I tell you, something ought to be done. Well, Dad, I guess we'll be up to the youth of the nation to solve its problems. Er, uh, yeah, yeah, sure, Specs. Mm, uh, guess you're right. Hmm. The vent from this abandoned warehouse will be the shell of our rocket. Roll away, men! Sending a rocket into space will be explained with its cosmographical map of the sky. The rocket will have to pass through the Milky Way, and if there are no bottlenecks, proceed past the Big Dipper to the Dog Star, which is at the halfway mark. Our final destination is the moon. Oh, Professor. Yes, Charles? Suppose our rocket misses the moon and winds up here. Then our secret timing device will speed up the rocket to land when the moon is here. Well, what happens if it goes to this side of the moon? The timing device will then slow it down to land when the moon is here. It's a toast! We know all! You win, Specs! All set for the solid fuel test, Goop. Pour in the fuel. Liquid fuel experiment going, Chubbs. All set for the test, Professor. Save the fuel. man for our rocket. Will a volunteer please take one step forward? Very well, Goop. Who, me? Now, due to the lack of gravity on the moon, we'll have to see how our spaceman reacts to weightlessness. Okay, Chubbs. <laughs> I'm a moon man! I'm a moon man! This centrifuge will test your ability to withstand the terrific pressure you will experience in space flight. Let it go! has blacked out. We will have to proceed with the pressure suit test. One pressure suit coming up, Professor. Oh boy, it's up to 40 pounds already. What's that rocket?
Oh, boy. It's Queen out of sight. Gentlemen, our launching was a success. Specs, off to the woodshed. Oh, well. Back to the drawing board. <laughs> <laughs>